木兰池。Ballad of Mulan. Yee yee chirped the crickets. Mulan sat in front of her loom. There was no sound from the loom, only the sound of her sighing. What are you thinking of, my daughter? What are you remembering? I'm not thinking of anything, dear father. I'm I'm not remembering. Last night I saw the twelve war notices from the emperor. Twelve times they called for you to lead the army, dear father. You don't have an older son. I I don't have an older brother. I would like to buy a horse and saddle and fight in your place. Mulan went to the east market to buy a fast horse. To the west to buy a saddle. To the south to buy a bridle. To the north to buy a long whip. In the morning, Mulan bade farewell to her parents. At nightfall, she arrived at the bank of the Yellow River. Mulan, the young general, could no longer hear the parents calling, only the splashing of the Yellow River. In the morning, the young general left the Yellow River and at nightfall arrived at the Black Mountain. The young general could no longer hear the parents calling, only the far cries of the enemy's war horses. The army rushed to meet the enemies at the battle front. The mountains and war posts flew by them. In the cold of the northern lights, the young general heard the night watchman's gong. The winter lights shone on the frosted iron armor. Generals died after hundreds of battles. Only the brave young warriors came back victorious. The young general came back to see the emperor. The emperor sat on the throne in his great hall. The record book registered great deeds over and over, hundreds of rewards to be given. Tell me, my young general, what would you like? Maybe to be one of the ministers in my court? I am honored, your Majesty. I would, however, decline to be a minister in your court. I would only ask to lend me your royal camel of the thousand-mile feet to take me home immediately. Mulan's parents heard that Mulan was coming. They rushed to the gate, leaning on their canes. Mulan's sister heard that Mulan was coming. She put on her makeup, facing the open front gate. Mulan's younger brother heard that Mulan was coming. He hurried to sharpen knives to slaughter pigs and goats for a feast. Mulan opened the door of the east chamber and sat on the westerly bed. Mulan took off the armor and put on the old skirt. She sat across the window and combed her cloudy hair. She carefully put on makeup in front of the mirror. She went outside to see the war comrades. They were all astonished. Fighting side by side for twelve years, we never knew that you were a woman. The male rabbit's leap is a little heavier. The female rabbit's eye is a little cloudier. But when they run side by side, who can tell the one from the other?